Okay, this is our solar powered off grid washing machine. And I'll show you how it works and how we use it to wash our laundry. It's pretty simple. Okay, so it has two main units here. This here is the washing. This here is the dryer. And the dryer actually works pretty well. We do plug it into this extension here, which is linked to our batteries and inverter, which I'll show you now. Okay, so on the top of the machine, we got our water inlet. We got a wash timer, so you can choose up to 15 minutes. We got a soft wash, standard. And if we switch it over here, it'll drain out the back here, which I have going into my reed bed. And the spin timer, so you can have this thing spin for up to five minutes, although you may not need that. And then there you go, there's the actual serial number and the make of this model. And now I'll show you how we use it. And if you're wondering what the specs are, here you go. We got a 230 volt, frequency 50 hertz, spin capacity 3 kilo, uh, what's that input, 240 watt, 120 watt, 360 watt, so there you go. Okay, so we're going to start loading this up. And when it comes to the water, we'll add some water in just a minute and we'll show you exactly how we do that off grid. Remember the max is sort of three kilos, so we don't want to put too much in here. And what we'll do is we add some water now. There's some markers on the side here, if you can see them. It says low, and medium, and high, so you can go ahead and fill it depending on how much clothes you're using. We're just using this uh, IBC container, taking some water out and filling it up off-grid style. I'm gonna go ahead and fill it up. What are we going for? Low, medium, high? Okay, so we're approaching the medium level. I just believe you don't want to fill it over that the top filter there. That might be a runoff there. There we go. We're filled up. Now we're going to add some washing detergent. You can't really tell by the label because we keep reusing it over and over, but this is a Faith in Nature eco-friendly uh, laundry detergent. We're just going to use a half a capful. Or a full, uh, one of, I guess a full capful. I don't know, we can edit this. What are you doing? Uh, we're cleaning the cap so you can't tell how dirty we are. Quick, pretend to be clean. I'll edit this. Hopefully. Uh, people will not be entertained at staring at these socks. Come on, give them some detergent. We want detergent. Oh yeah, pour it in. Yeah, alright. Oh yeah. Pour it in, baby. Okay, that's just it. Make sure your washing machine looks pretty before you turn it on. And then you go ahead and as long as you haven't exceeded the load, you should be good. We should turn this on and it should start functioning. All you gotta do is make sure it's plugged in. That's the number one thing, guys. Okay, make sure it's plugged in, just like I haven't, and then it should work. You can hear a little hum. It's come to life. It lets you know that it's thinking and it's considering the input. What, what should we go for? Six minutes? Crank it to six. 